What's up, everybody? This is Tanner from TamanBaseballFan.com. I wanted to show off my latest mail day today. I am super pumped. Uh, before I do that, I want to start off with a card that I have had, and I already did a video on this before, or it's made a, an appearance at least. Um, this is what I was planning on having as my lone bat barrel, uh, just because it's basically perfect. <laughs> it doesn't have a signature, but... Um, the barrel is like the best one I've ever seen. I just love that it is centered. It says Cooper Pro 100, has his name underneath it. The design is just flawless. I mean, everything is gorgeous about it. And so this was going to be like my de facto barrel. Um, I wasn't going to worry about getting any others. Uh, but that's not how I roll really. So here's what I did. I picked up another one. And I didn't even realize the significance of this one until a little later. Um, but take a look at this. Beautiful. It has a signature. Um, now the bat barrel is also extremely special. Um, I'll talk about that in a second. But um, I really do love the design. Like I don't know what they did here. And I take I pay more attention to this stuff, I think, than others normally. But there's a, a player in the background there. It almost looks like it's his reflection in the back. Uh, probably isn't, but, um, it's really kind of a neat little piece of it as well. Uh, I appreciate that they used green throughout the design with the gold foil. Um, and, uh, the signature, one thing that I really like about this signature also, by the way, is it is spread out. So I've seen a number of other barrels where that wasn't the case. And this is just like spread out and it's like perfectly, uh, in its section. So it's just a card that I really like, but probably my favorite thing about this is, well, let me, let me open this up and, and we're going to take a look and I will show you one of the things I got more excited about with this. Let me bring it closer to you here. You see anything? Let's turn this upside down. Right here, it looks like there's an imprint of a ball at the point of impact right there. You see that? Now also, um, and we'll we'll go through this uh, a little more in depth, but all this is glossy right here, except for this little point of impact here. So it's really cool uh, to see. So I'm gonna try to get a little closer. Can't quite make out what it says there, but you see like the letters kind of arching there. And then it looks like almost like a little bit of ink that smudged there and just really kind of neat. And also under microscope, you can see a little bit of ink here, which is blue. It looks like it came from a, from a baseball. So uh, this is really fun to me because uh, while this barrel here is basically perfect um, in design and presentation, this barrel here um, is really kind of the, it's really the only way I would have uh, been able to have uh, justify having another one because first of all, look at these together, guys, like dark and light, just amazing. One's got a signature, one doesn't. But instead of having all of the amazing, you know, logo and nameplate and everything material right there, we have encapsulated, a captured a piece of what makes Canseco so uh, special as a ball player. The point of impact on his bat barrel during a Major League Baseball game with a baseball. How cool is that? I'm just... I'm just really, whoops, I'm just really excited about that. I think they are, I think they make for a beautiful pair of cards. Double barrel, baby, just looks really nice together. Um, just for fun, I I did a couple stupid things. Number one, I put uh, uh, put the new card under a black light, and I also put it under a uh, uh, under a microscope. So I'll go ahead and show those as well, and. Uh, you know, it's just, it's just fun. Just, you know, me goofing off doing sciencey things, I guess. But um, anyways, there they are together, guys. Like, could not be happier with this pair. I think they go together perfectly. It's like these two barrels, they encompass everything that, you know, barrels should be uh, together. So it's really, really cool. Very happy with this, with this mail day. So thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. All right, everybody, so here I am in my bathroom. <laughs> I'm uh, going to uh, turn the black light on and show you my newest acquisition. It's a Conseco Bat Barrel. 
check this out. How cool is that? It looks beautiful. Um, I think a lot of it has to do with the holder, but um, man, it's it's gorgeous looking. It's really, really cool. Let me uh, put the black light over it a little more there. So how neat, huh? I wish all cards glowed like this just regularly. Really nice. All right, so here we are under intense magnification. <laughs> I don't know why I do this stuff, guys. I just love this, though. Um, you can see every little nook and cranny and the sap or whatever it is that's been used uh, on the bat. And uh, trying to get a closer look on uh, the stamping and stuff. But uh, anyway, it's just really neat. It's really fun. So I think this is the point of impact here. Um, where the ball, uh, where Canseco hit the ball. Um, really kind of neat to see this up close, guys. Like, I think there's, let me see where, I think there's a little bit of blue ink somewhere. If I can find it. Yeah, I think there we go there. Let me see if I can sharpen it a little bit. Yeah, yeah, look at that. This looks like that's uh, part of the ink from uh, from the baseball that was hit there. And uh, you can see the whatever the sticky stuff is that they use kind of smashed around the ball there, and uh, which is really kind of neat. Um, I think that's kind of where it looks like up close where the letters were. Kind of just follow along there. And uh, yeah, it's uh, <laughs> really cool. I'm going to go to a uh, more full section of the Rawlings logo. You see it's more dark. We'll go over to just wood. See how it's all uh, sticky and shiny looking there. All over the place. And then we get to over here, the point of impact, you see a noticeable difference. Yep, right there, whammo. So cool, so cool, love this stuff. Again, we'll go over here. Shiny, shiny, shiny. Shiny, shiny, and then where the ball hit, a lot more flat, all kinds of disturbances, very cool stuff. <laughs> I don't know why I love this stuff, but I do. Hey, while we're under the microscope, guys, let's take a look at the rest of the card, by the way, um, just for fun. You see the printing, wildly different from the old cards I've put under there, right? Uh, one thing that's kind of fun that I noticed is it's a little bit of an ink spot there at the top. You can't really tell uh, without the microscope. It looks like Jose dragged the uh, the pen a little bit there, so and uh, really kind of a kind of fun thing. But let's go over to the signature itself. It's just kind of fun, kind of fun to see this. Look at that. Beautiful signature under microscope. Flows beautifully, just incredible. Let's take a look at that tier one logo, the gold. Yes, sir. Look at that. How fun, right? I don't know. I love this. <laughs> it's so cool. Really, really neat. It's like a science project. If I had this for like Science in school, I would have gotten straight A's, no doubt. Anyways, there it is.